Hey everyone, welcome back. So Coursera is one of the biggest online platform in the entire internet to learn a lot of different things. Like if you want to learn coding, programming, data science, machine learning, AI, business, marketing, whatever you want to learn, Coursera has everything for you. But the catch is not all the courses in Coursera are free. Coursera has a subscription based service, which means you have to pay a certain amount and you get all the Coursera benefits for a certain period of time. After that, you have to renew that amount. But as a student, we don't have money. We don't have any financial assistance because a lot of us have some educational loans. A lot of us don't have this financial ability to afford that amount. I mean, Coursera amount are really huge. OK, but the good thing is if you're a student or if you're doing something, you can still do all the courses like all the entire courses of Coursera for absolutely free of cost. Also, at the end, you will get the branded Coursera certificates too. So basically in Coursera page, you can audit all the courses for free. What does that audit means? You can go to all the course pages. You can see all the lectures, but you cannot perform any quiz. You cannot do any assignment, any project, which means you can still perform, but your performance will not be evaluated. And at the end, you will receive no certificate from Coursera. But the technique and the method I'm going to tell you, it is from official Coursera. It is called the financial assistance. So if you apply for that, it will take some days after that, it will be automatically approved and you will get evaluated for all the quizzes, assignments and projects. And at the end, you will get the brand Coursera certificates, which will be really, really helpful to build your resume. So basically, there are two types of method by which you can do all the courses for free. The first one is financial assistance. And the second one is if you are in such a college which has taken the Coursera domain for their purpose and you can use as a college student, so you can do all the courses for free. So first I will show how to get all the courses for free using the financial assistance. But before that, wait, if you are a GATE aspirant, then why don't you participate this free scholarship test by an academy in this upcoming Sunday that is 20th of November. And you just participate and get a chance to win Apple iPad mini. Fitbit, JBL speakers, JBL headphones, or some amazing Amazon vouchers. Also, if you get a rank between 1 to 200, you get a chance to win up to 100% scholarship for the Unacademy Plus subscription. All you have to do is to just participate this free scholarship test. You don't need to pay any amount for that. And it is a live test of 60 minutes, which consists of just 20 questions. And why don't you ask your friends to participate in that? And also, you can check how much you can go ahead among your friends. And it's a free test series, and you will get a clear idea that which type of questions are going to be asked in real gate exam and also after the test is over you get the detailed and high quality video solutions by the top unacademy educators the test is available in both android app as well as their original website so what you have to do is just use my code manish majumda to sign in that test you don't need to pay any amount go to the link that is given in my description and join the test with unacademy let's crack it so this is how coursera actually looks if you open coursera.org so now here there are a lot of different courses you can watch and also you get all the courses listed here if you click on explore and you get all the different domains like if you need data science course if you need business computer science information technology so let's say i want to learn some computer science uh, courses so just uh, go to this computer science and you get to see all the courses some of the courses are free you get all the courses all the free courses from here so now let's say i want to learn some let's say web development so just click on web development all the courses related to web development are shown here right so let's say i will learn this html css and javascript for web developers this is from john hopkins universities and it will load up the page now you can enroll here for free but you have to pay some amount after i think seven days seven days free period but you have to provide the credit card details but if you're a student you don't need to do anything just click on financial aid available and it will also ask you the application take at least 15 days to get reviewed so you have to wait 15 days for that so uh, you can just do continue to the application now here is something that they want to ask that you share your accurate information like if you are doing job but you are providing you as a student this is totally not true and you need to commit to finish their courses because i think most of the students just do enroll there and watch some random lectures and then just leave the course so ethically if you are applying for any scholarship and you are receiving the scholarships you at least need to finish those courses so just uh, click these two check boxes and here write those things and just paste there uh, i agree to the terms above uh, just paste it and click on continue now you have to provide some of your educational background uh, you can uh, say you are a high school student some college student you have a master's degree 
or you can say the annual income if you don't have any annual income doesn't matter you just provide zero employment status uh, how much you can afford to pay if you don't have any money to pay for that you just mention zero here now the most important thing is you have to clearly mention why are you applying for financial aid you just put your uh, genuine thoughts that why are you applying for financial aid uh, if you're a student obviously just say ki, uh, you don't have money you may be having some financial loans or maybe you are not financially able to provide all the fees that this course is taking so just write in your own words don't just copy and paste it there are a lot of different sites where uh, people have written those things that why you need to uh, apply for financial aid and they just do a copy paste here don't just copy use your own words and i will guarantee you it uh, within 15 days it will definitely be approved and after that you need to mention that how will taking this course help you achieve your career goals so just write in your own words that why are you taking this course what are the exact parameters you are going to learn and what are the exact fields that this course will help you and what are the future target that let's say if you want to be a data scientist and if you are taking a machine learning course so just mention that i want to be a data scientist or maybe you want to be a web developer so that's why you are getting this web development course you may be a blockchain developer you are that's why you are using this blockchain so just clearly mention everything in your own words after that there is a section that asks you if you can afford some low interest loan uh, after you uh, complete the course so if you can't afford just uh, click on no and just answer it why you can't afford to pay the loans after that uh, click on this check box you are certainly not a robot and submit your application and within 15 days it will be approved i mean uh, for my case it was just the exact 15 days or maybe in some cases 14 days mein ho gaya tha. and the second one is if you are inside any college which has a custom coursera domain just like in my case i was a student of iit kanpu so they had the uh, separate uh, custom coursera domain from where you can use any of the courses you can get all the courses for absolutely free and you can give all the quizzes you can do all the assignment projects and at the end you get the branded certificates as well so if you have that opportunity you can use that you don't need to apply for financial aid so here you can see all the different courses that are available currently in this custom domain so i think after covid a lot of different colleges have applied for the custom coursera domain and they have some of them has already brought that so if you're a student of that please use it so i'll highly request you to choose that courses which are actually needed and you learn those courses properly okay don't just uh, you know go through all the courses and just leave after some point of time if you are learning a course try to finish that course the skill is important certificates will definitely make your resume beautiful but not you as a person because to be great as a person you need to be skilled and by learning you only get enough skill don't just say ki mera ek certificate ho gaya mera ek course ho gaya don't just say these kind of words try to learn those concepts coursera has been a brilliant platform over the last few years so just utilize this great opportunity everything is free so that's it for today's video if you have any questions drop down in my comment i'll try to reply all of that so if you like this video please hit the like button and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content so see you in the next video till then take care and goodbye